You can ask any student, especially if you're a parent, summer break is coming and you want something for the kids to do, the University of Winnipeg might have a solution for you. I'm here with Sheldon Appel. He's the sports information coordinator, but he's also the coordinator of the summer camps that are coming here starting July 3rd for another summer. Another year, yeah. Uh, we're all pumped and we're ready for it. Yeah, and so talking about uh, July 3rd, the Steve Nash basketball camp is, is coming back for another year. Talk about what that camp uh, is, does for the players. Steve Nash camp is uh, it's basically designed for um, you know kids anywhere from grades uh, one to five, and it gets kids involved in involved in the sport and those who have been playing in the sport before they could actually stay in the sport. Um, they learn everything from you know the basketball techniques, you know dribbling and shooting and uh, ball handling. You know they play a lot of scrimmages, a lot of one on ones, a lot of three on threes. But beside, aside from basketball, they also get involved in other sports as well. You know we play a lot of you know dodgeball or some volleyball or some soccer just. Uh, get the kids motivated, get the kids active, and staying in the gym basically is one of the most important parts. I love, I'm a big advocate of the uh, the cross sport uh, idea. And another camp that's coming that's been really popular is the HIT Camp, H-I-T-T -T Camp, it's for volleyball players. The HIT Camp is, uh, it's the second year it's been here, and uh, head coach Diane Scott was uh, very big in bringing it in last year. Um, we had about 36 um, girls last year in, in the program. Looking for, that will probably be sold out probably within the next month, I figure, because it's one of the popular camps we do have and it's for the advanced uh, training uh, volleyball players for the girls to learn about you know off court on court training nutrition um, scrimmages they do everything in that camp so it's crazy and Diane gets a good look at some up-and-comers as well so that's got to be good for the uh, the Westman program as well uh, now with the expansion of sports here at the University of Winnipeg there's also new camps soccer baseball and wrestling those uh, are three new sports and of course soccer um, getting into the CIS has been big for us so now actually get people familiar themselves with the Westman and soccer program CIS so we're looking for our numbers in the soccer camp to go up but we're also looking forward to the wrestling because now we've had our first season under our belt and now we could actually um, you know uh, look forward to those camps and also baseball that we actually now uh, played our first year and people know about our program and get their kids involved. And anybody that watched uh, really they saw how how much we followed them and they know head coach Mike Krykowicz great guy to learn from as well. If you want more information on those summer camps that get underway July 3rd and go all through the summer, whether it's a half day or a full day camp, you can find out all the costs at westman.ca and get registering early because as Sheldon said, they're going to fill up really fast. For Shaw TV, I'm Mitchell Clinton.